Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Curtis Pike. We're doing another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. Today we're going to look at the Proc Amp effect, or Procamp. I don't know how you want to say it. I think it's Proc Amp. Yeah, it's got to be Proc Amp. But uh, basically it's, it stands for Processing Amplification. Now this effect is in, go to the effects panel, under video effects, under adjust, Proc Amp, and then you just drop her on. I've got a channel muted unnecessarily. Pardon me. And here we go. Nothing happens out of the box. I get it. Uh, it's no effect yet. But you can actually get in and do some really good stuff. As you can see here, you can adjust the brightness, contrast, hue, and saturation all with this one effect. So let's say that you want to get a black and white effect on this. Super simple. Go to the saturation. Drop it to zero. All of a sudden you have black and white. That's really great if you're a filmmaker and you want to have like a flashback and sometimes flashbacks are, are done in black and white to sort of um, send people the cue that, yeah, hey, this is a flashback. Uh, so let's say, yeah, saturation, 100%. We'll go back up. If you want to super saturate it, you go up to 200%. Everything is bright and green and Alice in Wonderland. But anyways, let's go back to 100, go back to the default settings. So you'll see that you can do all of these things. And here's the really cool part about this is it allows you to split screen right there. So clicking on that doesn't do anything, but watch. Once you start changing values, you've got the changed value on the left, and then you've got the original footage on the right. It doesn't render like that, but you can see as you go what kind of effect you're getting. So let's say we've got a strange desaturated effect. We want it to be really blue, oh, purple. Okay, we're going to desaturate it a little bit so it looks like it's in some sort of warped dream state. And because we want to see more of this than the other one, we're going to do 70% of this split screen. No, go back to 50. But as you can see, the effects we're working on on the left side versus the original footage is all there for you to see. It is a fantastic effect. Off it goes, on it goes. That's what it's going to look like. So anyway, we'll go back to like a regular brightness of, I don't know, go to zero, contrasts, I don't know, 100, 200, sure, why not? Change the hue a bit, purpley, saturate it all the hell. And there you go, guys. We have a very strange effect. But take it, but seriously, give consideration to the processing amplification effect or proc amp. It's a fantastic effect. It allows you filmmakers to make changes and check them out as you go. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'll be back more with some new tutorials. Cheers.